right behind me is a technique known as glass blowing and the glass has to be set to 2300 degrees and then it needs to cool for a day before use. Now artists come from all over the country but some are local. I just love working with the molten hot material. It's kind of a mesmerizing material unlike anything I've ever, you know, worked with before. A unique aspect that makes this festival stand out from the rest is the partnership of Mobile Glass Blowing Studios right in their backyard. Americus actually has a long history of glass blowing. We have GSW has the, one of the only public universities that offers glass blowing. Um, and then we have uh, a local hot shop, Hot Glass Academy, and then the place where I work, which we have a hot shop, but we also manufacture the equipment. We always get tons of compliments from the community about just how interesting it is and seeing all the different artists and how they make things differently from one another. Several visitors have returned each year and they say the community engagement and the chance to taste original Georgia craft beer keeps them coming back. Fascinating, you know, you're watching them blow it and shape it and do what they do with the glass. It's pretty spectacular what they can do. Very important. Uh, it's, it brings a visual element. It also brings uh, brings you in contact with stuff that you don't normally see, such as glass blowing. Uh, One Georgia brewer says he can see the impact small towns have. Well, I've heard people that are here from Alabama. Uh, there's some people here from Illinois. I mean, there's even artists here uh, from Utah, as far as Utah. So it's pretty interesting how such a small festival is drawing people from so far away. Important that we support local, that we shop local, that we think of our local artists as actual artists because that's what they are um, and not for them to be overlooked. Sometimes it's easy to go outside of the community and find someone that does. The city hopes to bring new artists to this event and help support both local owned breweries as well as the glass to put on the event. Now Georgia has expanded to over 155 craft breweries. Fallon Howard, WALV News 10, your hometown news source.